It's still hot, but I'm gonna taste one. Mmm, that crunch. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm bringing you a little something different. If you follow me on Instagram, you know I love to cook and one of my favorite things to cook is breakfast food. Within breakfast food, one of my specialties is my breakfast potatoes. I've gotten quite a few requests for this recipe, although I do have a written recipe for it. Um, I just wanted to come and show you guys how I do it on camera. So if you wanna learn how to make the absolute best breakfast potatoes, then keep on watching. All right, y'all, so you're gonna wanna start off with peeled russet potatoes. I prefer russet. They're usually bigger and I like the texture after they've been fried. So you're gonna wanna start them off with being very dry. Potatoes already have a certain amount of water within them, so you don't want them wet from you rinsing them. You want them dry, that's why you see them on a paper towel. And you're just gonna wanna cut them into cubes. I make my cubes kind of big because I do like to break them up in the pan as they're cooking. So that's why you see me cut them up into larger cubes like this. So after they've been cubed, you're gonna get your seasonings. I'm adding smoked paprika. I'm telling you guys, smoked paprika makes a world of a difference. Then I'm going to be adding some sea salt. I usually do smoked sea salt, but that's what I had today. Then a little bit of garlic, some herb de Provence seasonings, and then a bit of onion powder. If you don't have onion powder, you can just dice up some onions and add them to the potatoes. So I'm gonna give the potatoes and the seasonings a good mix. So you wanna make sure that these potatoes are coated and that's why it's so important that your potatoes are dry because if they were wet, the seasonings would just fall right off of the potato and into the bottom of the bowl with the water. Y'all see that? I like to use a cast iron skillet. I just love to use a cast iron skillet for frying. You can use a regular frying pan, but today I'm using a cast iron skillet with some vegetable oil. And I'm gonna let you guys hear it as the potatoes hit the oil, a little frying ASMR. This oil is on um, about medium heat. I started as a, at a four, so it's a, it's a good medium heat. And I like to just mix the potatoes around, let them st sit still for a minute. I don't time these guys. It's all about watching and feeling the texture of the potatoes. Once the potatoes become soft, that's when I like to press on them and push on them to break some of them open and release the inner potato from the skin and it, it creates this like amazing crunchy skin. Like it's an amazing, amazing texture. So after a few minutes of letting my potatoes sit and mixing them around, letting them get nice and golden brown, I'm going to pull them out of the pan and let them drain on a paper towel. And after they've drained on the paper towel, you're ready to go. Alright guys, 
Look, the tasting. One of the crunchiest, munchiest. I hope y'all can hear that. When I do my, like this. Mmm. That's good. Mmm. y'all that is so good like, no matter how many times i make those potatoes they're just bomb every time and i've been making them this way for about three years at least so yeah if you made it to the end of this video and you haven't subscribed yet make sure you click that subscribe button so you can join the jasmine mitchell family and hopefully get more recipes in the future and i'll see you guys in my next upload peace